Hello. Hello. for today. Howdy! Hey there.
Welcome, one and all, to the world-famous Sandrock's own running of the Yakmals. Shout out to City Hall for inviting me here today. Uh, now, I'll bet some of you are wondering, why the heck do we all get together every year to try to bump Yakmals into each other anyhow? <clears throat> it is with great esteem that I shall now honor an age-old tradition and regale y'all with the tale that started it all. The Shonash Clash! Many years ago, the great-grandparents of our very own ranch couple, Cooper and Mabel, were traveling yakback through the Eufaula, delivering various supplies up and down to the earliest settlers, long before the railways were ever built. Back then, the only road was through a narrow part of the North Shonash Canyon, and one day, these two yak boys were passing through from both ends at the same time. They ran into each other halfway through, their carts in tow, each blocking the other's path. One called out, You back out so I can get through! And the other replied, No, you back out so I can get through! I'm more than halfway through the pass. You back out! No, you ain't! That's one-third and a quarter at best. You back out! This back and forth went on for hours, and pretty soon other travelers showed up and were understandably peeved at the situation. Funny thing about it all is this narrowest part of the past was no more than 30 meters long. They could have all been out there in a couple of minutes. But no, both of those fellas were too stubborn to back down. Soon enough, push came to shove, <laughs> literally. Other folks on Yakback started bumping into our two antagonists, front and back, till it was just bumper Yak Bedlam. In the craziness of it all, carts were knocked over, packs were cut open, food and other supplies were getting tossed all out on the ground. Before too long, everyone came to their senses. One person started to laugh. Then another, and pretty soon, they were all tumbling off their mounts, howling over the absurdity of it all. Here, I'm afraid, is where it gets dark. When they all looked around, they noticed that the two fellas who started this whole debacle were both dead as doornails, both of them with their hands wrung out around each other's neck. In all the chaos, it seemed those two boys really never had let their bad blood quit boiling. The rest of them, folks, they all picked up their supplies. It had gotten late. They camped out there at the pass and cooked up all the food that had fallen off the mule yaks and carts and such, conversing all about what had happened. Word spread and, well, <laughs> here we are, all these years later, still commemorating the event. So all y'all, I invite you to partake in the festivities. Hop on a yak mill, bump into your best friend, and uh, <laughs> try not to take it too personal if you get bumped yourself. With all that being said, I hereby declare the Sand Rock annual running of the Yak Mill Festival begun!
Take her easy. Nothing I can do to change your mind? Anything at all? Nope. Sandrock is history. I'm out. Well, that's just we'll like... Miss you. Good luck, you travels. Dang it. Ego's the best onslaught of this company ever had. What about me, sir? Boss, I heard there's a machine that does sorting. Maybe we could commission one from a builder to help out now that we're short-handed. Sir, what about me? Can both of you two shut up? I'm kind of emotional over here. Besides, ain't no machine that does sorting. No, I'm pretty sure she's right. Hey, Builder, over here! Do you know anything about a sorting machine? See, I knew there was such a thing as a sorting machine. You can research it with Director Chi, right? What do you say, boss? Can we make an official commission for a sorting machine? Uh, sure. I don't know, whatever. Who cares? I say we go for it. I'm not doing extra work just because Bama thinks this place is drying up. It's our best chance to stay in business, boss. We should take it. Yeah, yeah, all right. Even if I said no, looks like it's four, uh, three against one anyway. And one thing we don't do here at Ufala Salvage is undermine democracy. Yo, you heard the boys. One sort machine, hold the mustard.
proud of this one. We really made a difference here. Yay! Great job, everyone! I wonder what Master Verna would say about this. Catch you later. Nice! I think this will work perfectly. I'll go look at the bridge right away. Oh, right. Here's some of what you're owed from the budget for the project. I think I was supposed to give some to you on the front end. Oh well. like you figured it out. Here, take these as well. Planting in the desert is the best step we can take towards fixing the climate here in Sandy. Plus, you get to eat stuff. Glad to have you aboard. Oh, um, you're probably going to need more seeds and stuff at some point. Just check out Burgess's store at the water tower. The church is always supposed to stay stocked up. Now, I better make like a tree and get out of here. Catch ya. there. 
So long, partner. Sorting machine? Quite doable. Bring me five data disks and you'll have what you want. So long. Okay, I'll get started. Check your mail soon. We'll meet again. See you later.
Thank mm -hmm. you. 